playing. My name is Jesse Okay, and uh, I'm the newest recruit onto the Nigerian team, I believe. Um, triple jumper, born in London, lived in Nigeria a couple of years, and uh, now decided to return back and, and hopefully represent the team of world champs in, in the future. Tosin Oke came into prominence as a featured triple jump star after he won the European Junior Championship in 1999, beating the likes of European World and Olympic champion Christian Olsen from Sweden in the process. But with Britain having a rich surplus of world-class triple jumpers such as Jonathan Edwards, Philip Idou and Onoshe Achike, he found it hard to break into the team. He got frustrated with being overlooked time and time again, and in 2008, he made a decision to try his luck elsewhere, which gave his career a new lease of life. Okay, change allegiance to start competing for Nigeria, starting the rebirth of his career. Okay, it's been two years of stars in athletics. I already won the European Junior Championships, jumped 16, 57 as an 18 year old. So you're in the system and you're, when you're in the system, you don't think about anything else. I mean, in the past, my relatives have said to me, oh, why don't you compete for Nigeria? But I mean, my, re my relatives, they do their job. My job was an athlete and my job was to be part of a team and jump well. Athletics ultimately is individual. So essentially it doesn't really matter what team you compete for. It's about how good you are on the day compared to the rest of the world. It's about being the best in the world. And that's what athletes strive towards. But I, I mean, certainly from the UK, a lot of people understand why I've moved and um, a lot of people are thinking about it, but I think a lot of people are scared of Africa. So, I mean, that's the mindset of the people and that's the mindset that needs to change because ultimately, you know, I've, my skin my skin is not European, my skin is African. So, I mean, I've, I've done some time for Europe and now it's time to, to come back home and do my thing here. Tosin Oke represented Nigeria at the 2009 World Championship in Athletics in Berlin, setting a personal best of 16.87 meters. With his appearance on the global stage in Berlin and new status once again as one of the world triple jump elites, Oke started 2010 on high. In January, at the Aviva International Match in Glasgow, Representing the Commoy, okay, laid down the marker as he took triple jump victory in an indoor PB of 16.73 meters, which rank came equal fifth on the world rankings as at 30th January 2010. By February, appearing as a guest at the Aviva World Trials and UK Indoor Championship at the English Institute for Sports in Sheffield. He won the men's triple jump event and improved his PB in the second attempt with a leap of 16.76 meters. Later that month at the Aviva Grand Prix in Birmingham, he improved his PB to 16.87 meters and only fell by 8 centimeters to make the qualifying A standard for the World Indoor Championship in Doha in March. Athletics Africa spoke with Tosin Oke. So the new PB today. Thank you. Um, so, but unfortunately you couldn't make the, you asked to stay jump the standard for Doha. So what are your plans at Tiger for the rest of the indoor season? Um, at the moment, I'm going to go home, have some rest for two, three days. Um, don't have any plans at the moment. Uh, this was supposed to be the big one, but to be honest, I did the Nationals last week and I was hoping Phillips and Nathan would be there. They weren't there, so it was, it was one of those things you had to jump by yourself, 1676, it was okay. And I was just tired today, to be honest, but obviously, being that it's a nice place to jump, I just was able to jump another personal best. But my hamstring's still tight, I'm tired, I've done so many personal bests, it's, it's time to just chill out. But we'll see, I mean, if I get a call from the IWF, because I'm the, I should be in the world top, should be in the world top 10, I think, now. So, I may get a call from the IWF saying, come on, we're good, come and jump. But we'll see, we'll see. Um, we're to make it to Doha. Are you gonna concentrate on the the Union Championship and the Africa Championship, or are you just going to concentrate on the Commonwealth Games? Um, I'm going to do both because they're not too far. I mean, I, I don't struggle to, I don't struggle to, to double peak. So um, I'm going to concentrate on the on the African champs, especially more than the Nigerian champs, because the Nigerian champs, hopefully, as long as um, no one comes out of nowhere, um, I should win it. So I'm going to concentrate on that, get that one done, 
um, and then I'm going to really go for the African Champs and try and win that because that would be a really lovely title to have. Jump 17 there hopefully and, um, and make, it, make the World Cup team so it's all about making the World Cup team. It's over four years and I don't know if I'll be doing this in four years time so it's, it's, it's very important to make the World Cup team by winning the, or coming top two in the African Champs and, um, and obviously the Commonwealth Games comes two, three months later so I've got the time to wind down and build back up for the Commonwealth. So what exactly the things you're happy with today in your... I'm happy to jump a personal best. We're always told to be happy about personal bests. Um, I'm happy that I was able to respond when the big boys were there jumping 17, 20, 17, 30. I was able to respond and, and get my act together and jump a personal best. And I think I mean, on one of them I jumped 16, 40 and I just I bailed out the final phase. And if I'd actually finished that, I would have gone 17. But I mean, should have, could have, would have, I guess. Um, you know, it happens. And I'll jump 17. 17's there. I mean... I know it, my training partners know it, my coach knows it, so it's just a matter of time and I'm going to be patient because I always teach athletes or I always talk to athletes and say something that you should be patient if you're jumping well, it's going to come. So I've got to take my own words and, and be patient. So At the onset of the outdoor season in June, OK produced a man of the match performance of 17.05 meters to win the men's triple jump at the first premiership match of the 2010 British Athletics League. He further improved on that to win the Africa Athletics Championships in Nairobi in July with a new PB of 17.22 meters and was elated at being an African champion for the first time. Tosi Oki later presented Africa at the Intercontinental World Cup in Split Croatia in September before crowning his season in October with a gold medal for Nigeria soaring to 17.16 meters at the 20th Commonwealth Games in Delhi, India. 2010 was a great year for Tosi Oki on the second. Two years after making that decision to change allegiance to Nigeria, his career went through a new reawakening. 2011 promises to be a great year for Africa Triple Jump with Tosinoke and Ugo Schlake of Cameroon. <laughs> 